It's going to be Supernova versus Hyun to find out if we're going to have a, a new king or one that remains here. Is it going to be Hyun? So Hyun's already backed himself $125. Can he get 250 like Ghost User did today? Or is Supernova going to be the guy that makes it all happen for Terran? So let's jump in and introduce our two fantastic players. Is it Lowe's on Cloud Kingdom, which is what Supernova chose because he's a challenger? Run out of time. There it is. All right, so up here in the top right is Supernova that isn't playing Zerg according to the overlay, but it is Quantix Hyun. There he is, re-qualified for Code S. We'll be playing in the new Heart of the Storm Code S, GSL finalist in the past, at Quantic Hyun. But down, down, down is our Supernova. Azubu Supernova Kim Young Jin. Last name being Kim, Koreans always have the, uh, the last name first. Uh, 22 years old, very young, or young in the scene because there's quite a few experienced players. Uh, and nine times Code S competitor. That is impressive. Um, one award away from the Nest T, or one Code S away from the Nest T award. And we have a very early SCV. And this is what I thought we'd see from a Korean Terran with an eight supply depot. And look at Hyun sending his first overlord. I think both of these players out at BC have been playing quite a bit of HOTS. Seems and he doesn't like even reveal the Overlord. Because this, if you think about it, your first Overlord does not go that way. In a normal Terran vs. Zerg. Goes like along here. Yes. And this is why the Overlord, the barracks is placed there. Two drones have been pulled off. And Hyun says, I fear not for your peasantry. I am thou king in this tournament. And crosses his legs and slaps him with a stick. Because these two drones are going to stop that SCV from building a <laughs> <laughs> Supernova, shut down, and now he's got a gas and a late <laughs> barracks. And Hyun says LOL, because that's what it means in Korean. That says LOL, because that is funny. <laughs> Both of these guys with a funny little owl face too. And mm. yeah, so uh, for anybody that didn't know, where Z is on the keyboard, or Z for you Americans, is where the uh, laughing button is in Korea, the sound you make. Um, so when you've you got an English keyboard, they press uh, Z down like that. So a lot of laughter between these two guys. And in all honesty, out of BC, Supernova's in a bit of trouble. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it hurts. I mean, that, that build order is eight depot, Eight barracks, eight refinery. <laughs> Got like, a lot of SCVs of that build. That's not a lot of SCVs. He will still make a Reaper. Uh, but by the time the Reaper gets you know, out not there gonna across the map, there's going to be a queen or two out. Because he's going to hatch you first. He got really unlucky, too, with his SCV float pattern. This is a big thing when you play Terran. You yeah. want your SCV just to float into the middle. Yeah. And then maybe you can get that damn barracks built. But that, that SCV just floated right to the side. <laughs> <laughs> just floated right to the end. Served himself up on a platter. And seven supply lead here for, for Quantix Hyun. I'm very excited for Quantix year uh, having you know such a player like Hyun on their team. Uh, Hyun was actually teamless for quite a while. Yeah. I'm surprised he didn't join Azubu with the rest of his teammates, to be honest. You know, once TSL disbanded, um, a, a lot of them jumped boat over to Azubu, uh, a new fresh team within ESF. I have absolutely no idea what that means, though. He probably says, fuck, I'm screwed. <laughs> I'm <laughs> no. to take a guess at that one. Uh, but the queens are out now, and usually there's you know, a good 10 seconds, 15 seconds before the queens come out, and now there's like minimal. There's the lings by time without even dying, and the queen pops, and the reaper will do absolutely nothing from here. Um, he's got a second reaper on the way, a factory being built, and obviously Hyun goes in and sees all of this. Uh, and from this position, he's just going to add on queens, uh, Queen is almost falling off, and that second line doesn't mean anything in Korean, and that says ha ha or he he. <laughs> <laughs> so he's, he said something, and then it's he he, uh, been said by Hyun. Um, so yeah, or uh, at least something similar, sounding similar. But well, this game. It started rather poorly for Supernova, who's about to lose this Reaper as well. And there'll be a Queen on the low ground, and that Reaper shouldn't really get away. Actually, there it is. No, he's dead. He's dead. Well, 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 Supernova. I understand it's, it's probably 6am in Korea right now, but... It's time for the Battle Hellion follow-up, alright? You reckon he's going to throw down an armory? 
Well, I mean, typically that's what you do. You go into battle hell and drop after this. But he's done zero this. damage. Zero. He hasn't even... He well, hasn't he even... killed four Zerglings. Oh, he killed a, a drone and two Zerglings, so... That's not enough, though. You don't think? No. After going... Not eight, enough to eight, go eight battle eight Hellions. And having to cancel. No, not, not to go battle Hellions. Because, <laughs> I mean, if you think about it, he's got only just enough gas now to throw down the star pot and armor is one. It's so late. By the time they got there, there'd be 50 drones and 20 million units. And it looks like he's just trying to play this game from behind. Stim, Hellions, Marines... Uh, layer coming down, four gas has been taken, um, and double evolution chamber. So just super normal play from Hyun. Uh, with the layer coming down, he may want to use an Overseer pretty fast. With a Mines coming out though, always can be game changers, depending on how they get in, where they get in, what do they kill, and how much do they kill. But with the layer on its way so early, it's going to be a quite early uh, Overseer, queens are going to block the entrance just about. Not really, you know, anything apart from four queens, but four queens versus four Hellions. Four queens win. And we're going to have a Roach Hydra play here, or at least Roach Hydra potentially Swarm Host play coming out from Hyun with a plus one attack being researched here. Uh, he's not going to just build safety Roaches. This is going to be quite heavily uh, with Roaches. Very fast, risky third thrown down from Supernova at 46 support height. I mean, he's got to gamble, right? Yeah. So it's, it's certainly not something we can really fault him for. Uh, the Widowmine going to try and get in there, but like I said, the, the Overseer uh, can be made and is being morphed. So the Widowmine's going to plant in there, um, gets the Overlord, gets, kills an Overlord, both of them, and run away. Nice little harassment there. But now the Roaches are coming out, and this third will obviously not go down. And with four Overlords on the way, what we'll see is these Roaches, depending on how he wants to play it, two ways. He builds a lot of Roaches right now and goes with plus one on Roach speed or he builds drones. Roaches is the way he's doing it. So what he's going to come now for with that Overseer, especially when he sees his third, oh, is yeah. just two base. Two base Roaches. Plus one speed, probably won't even drone. He can drone after if he wants to, but with the amount of Roaches he's building, this could end the game. There's so far behind Supernova, supply blocked at 54. Um, uh, incredibly far behind from the get-go with that build being shut down has nothing to defend he'll have to lift his third he may be able to defend his natural widow mines and a, a repair on his stim marines but he Hyun is looking for the kill he's looking for the kill he's, he's thirsty he's looking for blood and he's probably gonna get it I think so I think so too with burrow on the way as well you know he'd be able to micro those roaches this is kind of nasty. And deservedly so. I mean, Supernova opened up with such a build that got shut down. These are going to go down. Oh, look at that. Pull in a couple. I, I'm not sure if that was intentional or not, but, you know, it, it did the job anyway. Which is just do damage with a small amount of roaches, which was two. And now the rest is here to play. And this is going to be a good game. There's no way he can defend this with plus one attack on these. Even if he does, he'll lose almost all his SUVs. Yeah, so much there's there. Just, there's just absolutely no way. Like, he, the Marauders are going to get... He's, he's messing around, borrowing up and down, healing a little bit. Look at that. He's teasing. Mana dance. dun dun da 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 Mana mules. And look at this. Good game. And these guys being super playful, super cheery at 6 o'clock in the morning or whatever it is in Korea. So thanks to you guys. If you ever watch the VODs, which you probably won't for playing, I'll message them afterwards. Uh, but it is very, very early over there. But game number one going quite convincingly there over to uh, Hyun. And that's twice that build's been shut down. So if yeah, you guys want to go, if you wanna go tweet at Idra, uh, JIT. <laughs> <laughs> Let him know. <laughs> so, uh, good game there. Uh, no offense, Greg. Uh, don't hit me next time you see me. And we'll be getting ready for game number two here. We'll be starting in a couple of moments. Uh, map. Alkaline Waste. Ooh, surprise. So, jumping over to that map in a couple of moments here for you guys. Uh, hope you're having a lot of fun here. Remember, the subscriber games are coming up next. Uh, after this best of three is finished. And we will have a king for the day. Whether it will be Hyun with two or Supernova with one. And we'll be announcing... When are we announcing the players for the next one? It's not today. Uh, not well, ready it was yet. supposed to be today, but you, I'm not ready. Didn't, you didn't do your work, Sean. I'm not ready. So you're going to be reprimanded. I'm going to make a and video again. we'll find out on the weekend. Tomorrow or... Yeah, it's probably Wait. tomorrow. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll promise I'll get it fixed by tomorrow. Promise. Right. 
I will make a video like I did for the player announcement for day two tomorrow, and it'll get uploaded tomorrow, and it'll be out public tomorrow. Saturday's too late. Friday's cool day. Um, so it'll be done tomorrow. So the players get announced for day three tomorrow, and we will at least find out one of the players. Trust me, though, the players that I've kind of... I've already got half of them, I think, and the ones I have got... We've got one who's really just good confirmed. One? For tomorrow confirmed? Wait, we have a for couple. For Sunday, I have a couple. Wait, tomorrow? Oh, What's man. tomorrow? Nothing. Nothing. Oh. So talking about tomorrow, man. Let's jump in this game. Tomorrow, Friday? Yeah. Okay. I'll do the announcement tomorrow. I won't get the... Whatever, that is. Get your shit together, Sean. 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 My name's Sean, okay? Sean. Sean. You're, you're only Apollo to me. All right. Sean All right, jumping in name. to this next game. A killin' wastes. Akalon. A killin'. I All totally right, so. changed color. Just so see, we've done really good with keeping the colors on par, but Scriff now has to has fix to them. Adjust. All right, so up here in the top left, it is Quantix Hyun Supernova. <laughs> As I said, <laughs> things have got screwed up. It's Supernova. And in the bottom, it is Hyun. Playing as Terran. Yeah. Kinda. Fail. <laughs> so, are we gonna see the, the Muslim follow up where you just go command yeah. center first? Yeah. Pretty sure. Good luck, have fun. Super Seven says, no, good luck. <laughs> Smile of face, good guy. These guys, of course, friends. A lot of the Koreans are very friendly towards each other, actually. There's a lot... There is minor rivalry, but not as intensively as there is outside of Korea, I felt. Yeah. Would you agree with that statement? <laughs> People don't get mad. Like People do. don't get mad. <laughs> People aren't all mad. Yeah. I mean, because if you look at Parting today, when he... I'm not going to say anything. Wait, spoilers. Yes, when he lost... Ah, well. you spoiled it, not me. So where's you pass it when he lost today? You know, he was like dancing his units and like congratulations compared to, you know, people that do get upset more. I thought he cried. He also cried. Uh, Excuse me. Also cried. Okay. Uh, all right. So we do have the hatchery first coming down and we will have the Muslim follow up, which is just command center here. And even on the low ground, Ooh, saying cheeky. whatever. And that's going to be quite annoying because there will be a drone there to prevent that from going Never down. Never mind. <laughs> I guess I'll go back to the high ground then. And uh, he makes his jolly way up there. And we'll see who's going to grab the last $125. Remember, there is $500 per day, four days uh, in the two-week period that we're going to be doing this for these players on giveaway. Thanks to you subscribers to the, the Good Studio channel. And you guys are probably going to get beaten up by me later on. Mm -hmm. So not only do I beat you at games, I'll take your money too. And, well, this drone's going to get away with one hit point there. And we'll go home. But the follow-up from this, pretty early refinery. Uh, not early, sorry. Uh, normal refinery timing here. Uh, and the reason why I get the refinery timing here... These guys do like talking, don't they? Sorry, I hate you. Um, but yeah, so the refinery timing comes down here is that you can get about three marines, and then by the time three marines are done, you can go over to a factory really early. I love you. Aww. Aren't these guys cute? Supernova, more so, uh, with his uh, recent plastic surgery changes. <laughs> Looks a lot different. And sorry, I'm not gay, says Hyun. And it's like narrating a story is <laughs> reading over the chat. So as you can see, um, it, you can get the gas at that time. I like trying to speak so strategic, and every time I say something, these guys say something more. Hug for me, come on. Okay. Friendly banter. Kind of getting a bit repetitive, but... Friendly banter, but deadly StarCraft is the name of the game this time out of BC. Mm -hmm. A roach warren early. We're going to see about... Eh, I think you can squeeze out about eight roaches by the time this is ready, maybe ten. Uh, as long as you don't get speed, that is. And he's looking to punish this command center first. You mean Burrow? He can't you get speed. You mean overlord speed? Zergling speed, I meant. Oh, zergling speed. Oh. Without zergling speed, sorry. Uh, but either way, uh, looking at this right now, is that that barracks needs a tech lab, and it needs it fast, but it's got a reactor for the factory. So unless that picks up and goes over to a tech lab and starts to build a marauder, 
maybe we'll see Widowmines. You know, Widowmines are good defensively yeah. here, if that's his opening. But if we compare it and look at patterns of how players play, in the last game, he opened up with Hellions, even from behind. So I think he's going to open up with Hellions again. And there's 10 Roaches, as, you know, predicted. If it's Widowmines, it's the best case. Hellions, not so much. Yeah, I think he can get away with these Hellions and then two Widow Mines and then just good SCV control and not good get control. tremendously far behind. But this is tricky no matter how you swing it. But he doesn't have a third command center as well, which is the big, you know, play here. Because you can actually lose a bit and recover easily with a yeah. third command center, but there isn't. But there is a full wall off with good repairs, with Hellions shooting down. He will lose SCVs for sure, especially if he spots it. He's no idea hands. right now. And oh, he's not going to oh, see. Oh, he's going the other way. Is he does he even go the tower? to the tower? Okay, he does. And now he sees it. And now he has to pull SCVs. And the tank is building too. And this is going to be close because he will lose SCVs. There's only two Marines actually doing the damage here. These Hellions have to micro from behind as well. And SCVs are going down by numbers here. And we're going such, fast, uh, such an early tank as well. Like I said, there's no third command center. So he'll kill SCVs all day here. He doesn't need to break this. That's like 10 SCVs. He's killed 33 of the 23. And Hyun is just wiping the floor. I think he could be just dead. I think he could be just dead. We'll see. That tank should be popping out any second now. If this tank pops oh. out the wrong way, he needs to come out like... Okay. Right. But at the same time, he can still go for it. He can kill all these SCVs. He's splitting up his roaches. This is it. This is the way that the King of the Hill yeah. Day 2 is going to end. It's going to end it. with the roach attack. It's going to end with two series of the so fast. All these SCVs go down. He's got 19 SCVs versus 41 drones. The tank is going to fall. Wow, narrowly. Narrowly falling. And here we have a couple of just... Hellions trying to do something here. They prevent a third order attempt to prevent it. Don't get it down. And 15 SCVs to 40. 20 supply, 26 supply to 61. Oh, dearie me. This game just got bad. I mean... The series for Supernova, you know, it's, to be honest, it's hardly worth his time staying up till 6 a.m. You know, the way that he's played, the, the, the Reaper opening got shut down, this got shut down. He's been completely cut before he even been able to play, unfortunately. You know, from one extreme to the other, whether it be a super aggressive play to greedy play. Oh, oh dear. This is actually, um, to, to, you know, if you look at people looking at the Supernova play, what should have, could have Supernova done different is not add the reactor on the barracks, which is, uh, if you look at Terran plays of recent, they don't do that so much anymore. They get the reactor on the factory, and they get an earlier tech lab for earlier stim and early marauder. Flash has been frontier in this to back up my sources uh, when going command center first. Other players that have done it as well is that they don't always get the reactor down on that barracks. They get it on the factory for defensive reasons. And, well, Supernova plays on, but like we saw in the previous game, he played on then and got absolutely trounced. And with speed about to finish, a lot of roaches on the way, Boro coming as well, Eric and Micro, we're going to have a similar situation. The one thing that, you know, Supernova can hope on for here is that he just starts barreling roaches into a wall where the tanks yeah. do cost-efficient damage, and he doesn't break the wall. You know, that's the kind of only thing he's hoping for. He's got one tank. He's about to have number two. Ah. Uh, is just constantly scouting with the Silverseer as well. So he, yeah. he's going to know, and he's going to be fine with trading. Even if he wants to charge up here, use Burrow a little bit, use yeah. some scans. He's going to snipe the bad. bunker and just run in. Snipe the bunker, run in, go to the tanks. Hellions trying to hold position there. Nice position from the Hellions, but the bro Roaches break through. No pulling from SCVs to repair the tanks. Burrow goes down. He doesn't have a scan because he would have scanned earlier. And now that the second tank's going to fall down. And this is going to be the end of this game. Another good burrow movement there. The roaches do regenerate. Good game. Hyun, two wins. Ghost user, two wins. Hyun remains our champion here uh, and remains our king. And are we going to see a repeat of what he did at IPL? Because now he will go on to fight for day number three. A very long early half, a very short second half of the day out of BC. Yeah, I mean, those first games were long. I, I really definitely enjoyed probably the, the Hasselwad's Ghost User Series the most. Yes. That, that was a real treat to watch. But yep. here we just had Keanu really just... 
Yeah. Face stomping some nerds. Face stomping nerds. And he did it hard. He, he wiped the floor with Ghost User and he wiped the floor uh, with Supernova. So Hyun will be our first player jumping into day number three. And I will announce the players tomorrow. I'll make a video. I'll tweet about it. It'll be on my YouTube channel. Uh, and you can all find that there. Um, so that's us done for the King of the Hill day two. I hope you've enjoyed it at home. I hope you've enjoyed it out of BC. Thanks for production 